hey guys, how y'all doing tonight? Guess what? Somehow, for the last, since I started it back in February, I have somehow managed to avoid this, but I have been cornered by two cats and a mouse. I have been tagged. Tagged to answer 30 Disney questions in five minutes or less. So, um, I don't know if anybody saw the video or if you guys subscribe to Two Cats and a Mouse. They're uh, uh, a married couple that are huge Disney fans and they make really great Disney vlogs. Right now, they're actually at Disney World and that's where they tagged me from, Magic Kingdom. I thought that was freaking awesome. Um, I was watching their video, I had no idea. And then uh, there, you can see the castle in the background and my name's Traveling Spanky. You've been tagged. And uh, I was flattered, to tell you the truth. I was, I was really flattered. And uh, I'm excited to do these 30 questions. And uh, I hope I, I don't know if I'll do them in five minutes. And I I, I haven't researched, or I mean, I haven't really studied those questions. I've, I heard them when they did the 30 questions. So some of those are still in the back of my mind. Uh, so I haven't cheated. I haven't, like, printed them out. And, uh studied those questions so I'll do the best I can in five minutes so let's get started first question wait a minute something's not right here I, I just don't feel like I'm not in the right mindset to do Disney questions hmm let me think oh much better I think I can do this now. First question. When was the first time you went to Disney World? Mm, let me think about that. I think I was 13. Hmm. I think I was 6 years old. Actually, I was 4 years old. Hmm. Oh, what happened? That's right. I'm... But I'm answering a question, I think. Oh, I forgot to set the time. Uh, let me start that now. There we go. Start five minutes. Oh, uh, that first question. Uh, oh, what was the first age that you went to Disney World? Um, I was four years old. I, I remember now. Yeah. I think I had some help remembering that, but yeah. Four years old. Um, favorite Disney World park? Uh, it's got to be Magic Kingdom. Uh, that's the original. It's the first park I ever went to. So that has a special place in my heart. I always will. Um, favorite land? Um, I don't know. Um, I guess where my favorite ride's at. Uh, Adventureland. Um, favorite on-site hotel? Um, I'd have to say, uh, if you've watched my videos, I talk about it a lot. Um, Port Orleans French Quarter. Uh, overall, that's the best place, um, I think, to stay. Uh, for the price, everything that you get, French, can't beat it, French Quarter. Um, favorite snack? Wow. I don't know. Um, oh, uh, the Mickey Mouse pretzel. Um, I can't read it. Oh, favorite souvenir. Um, favorite souvenir, favorite souvenir. Um... That's a tough one because I'm always buying the kids souvenirs. Uh, never really, I guess it would be like a hoodie, a, a new shirt. Um, I'm always, I like the clothes that they got down there. Um, favorite table service? Um, man, these are tough. I can't think. Favorite table service? Um, I guess not favorite food, but favorite table service for environment would have to be sci-fi. Sci-fi driving at um, Hollywood Studios. Um, favorite counter service. So this is easy because I just went in January and we went to uh, the Tall Tale, Pecos Bill Tall Tale Cafe over in, uh, what is that? That's in Frontierland. Uh, we got there right at 1030 when it opened. It was awesome. The food was great. Um, favorite character dining. I've only done that a couple times. We did the uh, 1900 Park Fair. That was Alice Wonderland characters. And we did the Crystal Palace, which is Winnie the Pooh. Um, probably going to go with 
1900 Park Fair, only because the Mad Hatter. I thought the Mad Hatter was really cool. Uh, favorite ride. Favorite ride. Well, Pirates of the Caribbean. The Haunted Mansion is right up there. It, it, it's almost a tie. That I'm going to go with Pirates of the Caribbean. Even though I like, I love the Haunted Mansion memorabilia stuff better. But the ride, I'm going to go with Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, least favorite ride? Uh, anything at Spins. Teacups at Roller Coaster and Animal Kingdom at Spins. I never rode that. I never rode teacups. I, I'd, I'd be thrown up. So that, that's got to be it. Favorite show? Mm. Favorite show? Um, hmm. I can't, I don't know, it's, I'm going to say Hall of Presidents, just because I saw that, when I, I think that's the very first thing I ever did at Walt Disney World, we went and saw Hall of Presidents, and I was like four years old, I was, I was scared to death of the Presidents, uh, it freaked me out, um, but I thought it was at the same time so cool, um, so I'm going to say Hall of Presidents, because it's been there forever, and it's, it's the first memory, really the first memory of attraction that I have at, at Disney World. Uh, favorite Epcot Pavilion, or I'm sorry, favorite parade. Uh, that's going to be the Halibu, uh, or Boo to You, Boo to You Parade at Halloween. It was awesome. Favorite fireworks, same thing. Halloween fireworks were great. Favorite Epcot Pavilion, uh, Mexico. Favorite, or last Magic Band color was blue. My favorite color. Uh, favorite character meet and greet. Uh, face character meet and greet. Um, favorite character meet and greet. Face character. I'm running out of time. Um, I don't know. Uh, Peter Pan. Favorite non face. That's easy. Uh, that would be Captain Hook. Favorite character I haven't met. Uh, Jack Skeleton. I think I really want to meet him. I think that'd be so cool. Uh, favorite attraction no longer there. Um, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride, even though it is at Disneyland, but I've never been to Disneyland. Um, best West or Walt Disney World memory. That's gonna be. Ooh, that's a toss up. I'm over five minutes. Um, anyway, my first memory. It's going to either have to be my the first time I went when I was four years old because it was just so so magical. It was just, I had no idea where we were going. So I'm going to have to say my first time. And I'm going to have to say my honeymoon with my wife. Oh, we had a great time on our honeymoon. I think we were there for like two weeks. We had a great time. Um, favorite. Favorite time. I wrote these down real fast. And I don't, I can't read my own writing. Um, favorite water park is going to be Typhoon Lagoon favorite slide I don't know the names of the slides I would, I'm going to say my favorite thing there was the uh, Lazy River Monorail or Ferry Monorail uh, movie they most like represented in the parks uh, Nightmare Before Christmas favorite dance party um, I really don't have one I can't dance you do not want you do not want to see me dance and I've got a story to tell you guys. I got a video coming up about when I tried. I tried out to be a Walt Disney World character when I was in college, and um, yeah, I can't dance. Um, favorite Main Street shop? I guess the Emporium. Uh, favorite Disney Spring shop? Um, I can't think of any of the shops. Other than it seems like we're always in Lego. The Lego. World, so I'm gonna say Lego World. Uh, favorite seasonal event. Uh, favorite seasonal event. Food and wine. And I skipped one. Uh, favorite time in, at Walt Disney World to go to Disney. Um, I'm gonna say Halloween. Uh, I've never been there at Christmas. Been there at Halloween, and I, we had a great time. Uh, like I said, I love the fireworks. So that's it. Uh, I fell <laughs> seven minutes and eleven seconds. I thought I'd do better than that, but I talk too much. I ramble too much. Anyway, I want to thank two cats and a mouse uh, for thinking of me. Um, 
uh, um, like I said, I'm flattered that you did. Um, I think it's awesome, especially the way you did it, the Magic Kingdom. That that was special. That you actually, Mom, I crossed your mind while you were down there in that magical place. I kind of felt like I was there with you. So thanks again. Uh, if you guys have not checked out their channel, uh, Two Cats and a Mouse, I suggest that you do that and subscribe to them. Check out their videos. Um, they're great. They're great people. And uh, I hope that I get to meet them someday. And now I guess I need to tag somebody. I'm going to tag, uh, and I, I apologize if you've already been tagged before. I don't know who has been tagged and who hasn't. But I want to tag Girl Meets Neverland. And uh, I will send you a message, and uh, hopefully that you'll get it. I know you're a pretty big channel, but I'm hoping you'll see my uh, my message and my uh, tag to you. And I hope uh, hope to see your video soon.